What's going on guys? I'm here once again with Evans Okacha Connector Careers Mode on Madden 13. And the Cowboys, well, they've been the Dallas Cowboys this year. There have been no surprises, I would say. Uh, what I say about the Cowboys is I'm never surprised whether they win or lose. I'm never surprised how they manage to lose. And so we're a 3-5 and five team. We've lost in a variety of ways this year. But uh, one thing that's been consistent is turnovers. And so coming into this game here, we have four games left into the division. Two against Philadelphia and two against Washington hoping we can get on track somehow and just manage to come away with some victories in the division with Washington playing so well and being a three and five football team right now we have the talent to win any game we play we also have the capabilities to shoot ourselves in the foot on any given Sunday and so it's seven nothing here early Philadelphia on top Tony Romo finding Miles Austin underneath for a first down that's a nice play that's gonna be good for nine yards and we go ahead to the next play and Romo back in the pocket now firing right side, looking for Witten, and it's going to be incomplete. Uh, Namdi Asamoa came over and was helping on coverage. Third and nine then for Tony Romo, and well... Here we go again. Akeem Jordan with the interception over the middle. It's Philadelphia football. And they would actually end up punting. Uh, this is a couple of drives later, though. Um, we traded punts for a couple of drives. And then we have great field position here at the 37-yard line after a short punt out of the end zone by Matt Turk. And now Okacha in the ground game. A first down going ahead up the gut for about 12 yards on that carry. And then we go with Tony Romo back to throw now on first down over the middle. Wide open is Jason Witten. And he he is smacked. That's going to be 13 yards. He hangs on for a first down. And now second and eight. We do an end around to Des Bryant. And nobody was fooled, including the great Jason Babin. And so that forces third down and long for Romo now. Fires to the end zone. And Okacha can't hang on. He's hit by Namdi Asamo at the goal line. And we have to settle for a Dan Bailey field goal. The score is now 7-3 in the second quarter. Miles Austin, nice catch over the middle. Hangs on for about 9.5. And, and then pitch outside for Okaja looking to get the first down yardage. He does get it to the Dallas 40-yard line. And that brings up a new set of downs, of course. Tony Romo back in the pocket now. Looking outside, and that was not the right decision there, Tony. It's intercepted by the rookie second-round draft pick, Michael Kendricks. And he is going to take this one to the house. It's a 40-yard interception return for a touchdown. And it's going to be 14-3. Three going ahead now for Philadelphia. We come back. Our next possession wanted to do a screen pass to Des Bryant and instead Cullen Jenkins sacks Tony Romo. Third down and six, and Romo under pressure again. But Ogletree makes a nice catch over the middle. That's good for a first down, and that's going to keep this drive moving for the Cowboys as they t attempt to get some momentum back in this game. Jason Witten over the middle, another first down as Romo's making some nice throws here to get his confidence back. And then he goes out of the backfield to Evans Okacha Ajukina. I always jump for some reason because I, I want to get my Jerome Simpson on, I guess. And then we're going to go over the middle to Des Bryant. First down to the 34-yard line of Philadelphia. And Edge of field goal range for Dan Bailey, but we like to get six points to make this a closer game. Third and four, Romo fakes the handoff to Okacha and goes outside. That's Jason Witten at the first down marker as he does make the catch and gets the conversion. We fake the handoff once more, then Romo wants to fire to the end zone and touchdown, Jason Witten. A perfectly executed play from Tony Romo to Jason Witten. And we go to the second half, and Philadelphia would begin the second half with a touchdown, making it 21-10. And the Cowboys have the ball now. Okacha takes a seven-yard carry to the right side. Second down for Tony Romo. He's got good protection. He finds Des Bryant coming across the middle on a shallow drag. That's going to be good to get to the 40-yard line. And now second down and four. Romo, quick pass outside. Okacha, first down and more. He crosses midfield, and it's going to be a fumble but this would be overturned on a booth review. Therefore, the Cowboys keep possession in Philadelphia territory on third and four. We pitch outside instead of going through the air, and it works to perfection. Evans Okacha takes the pitch, some great blocking about the right side, and he gets a big first down now as the Cowboys are in the red zone. Fake the handoff to Okacha, but then here comes the blitz. That's Marsh tackling Tony Romo back and forcing fourth down and a Dallas field goal attempt. It's 21-13 now. Dallas with the ball again. Romo, deep shot for Cole Beasley, and he dives and can't hang on. He got a catch up. 
that one though, man. No one around you. Third down and five for Romo, and he fires Jason Witten and hits him in the head, and uh, not on the same page there. So we end up punting the football, and Philadelphia attacks on a touchdown, and we'll punt the football later. We're in the fourth quarter, down by 15. It is crunch time. Okacha calls fair catch, and I'm about as confused as anybody right now. And Okacha's gonna break to the outside now. He's gonna go ahead, cross midfield, and he's gonna get a huge return after calling fair catch, and they didn't call the play dead. I have no idea what just happened. But uh, Dallas gets the ball now in Philadelphia territory. Ogletree with a big catch here, 18 yards and a first down. Second down for Tony Roma, three receivers out of the shotgun, and he's going to be sacked on the play. That's Trent Cole coming off the right side, and that forces third down and long with his 15-point deficit. Romo, though, he takes a three-step drop and is immediately hit. Okacha's like, come on, man. And we play it safe and kick the field goal. It's 28 to 16. Our defense does a great job of forcing a three and out. And Okach is going to get a legit return this time. It's going to go on top of the Eagles logo to the 47 yard line, where we set up shot for Tony Romo to continue firing the ball down the field. He finds Des Bryant for a first down. But we do have to get two touchdowns. Second down and five for Romo out of the gun. Over the middle, it's behind Okacha, forcing a very pivotal third down and five with just over three minutes to go in the game. Okacha over the middle again. He makes this catch and is tackled by Casey Matthews. That was a huge catch for Okacha. And then Romo on first down, outside pass to Miles Austin, who somehow tiptoes the sidelines and remains in bounds for the first down. And then Romo out of the backfield. Okacha to the inside of the five yard line and to the one where he's out of bounds now to punch it in handoff Okacha going up trying to jump up and they call touchdown Cowboys but wait a minute here a booth review for the automatic uh, review on the score it was a close play and the booth review would end up overturning the call and so second and goal now from the one yard line Okacha going up the middle nowhere to go offensive line got zero push that forces third and goal from the three we're very stubborn on offense here handoff Okacha goes nowhere loses a yard and that forces Forces fourth and goal. We have to go for it here. A nine point deficit does us no good. And so Romo fires over the middle. It's caught by Witten and touchdown Dallas. They would review it, it would stand. And so now our defense, one more stop, and we can get a touchdown and get this win. And we force a three and out, and we'll get the football back with just over a minute to go. Plenty of time, three timeouts. Maybe it's destiny. Okacha fields a punt from his 37-yard line and continues up the field. He goes up across midfield and out of bounds at the Philadelphia 44. Great field position for the Cowboys now as they set up shop. Romo fires over the middle. That's Des Bryant beating Dominique rogers Camardi, and that gets him to the 28-yard line. Now they're very comfortable. They can definitely get into the end zone from here, and they're going to take a shot. Okacha, it's tipped away, and Okacha wasn't exactly in the greatest position there, and we're going to go ahead to third down and 10 from the 28-yard line. Tony Romo over the middle, Miles Austin breaks off of a tackle and gets the first down. 16-yard line now for Romo in the pocket going end zone, looking for Witten, and it's caught but on the end line. And so no touchdown there, forcing second down and goal out of the shotgun. Romo's got to go to the end zone. He throws it up, and it's caught. It's Des Bryant. He has done it. Touchdown, Cowboys. Are you kidding me? This is very uncharacteristic. Bryant jumps up, takes it off DRC, and he hangs on, and his fingertips are definitely not out of bounds on that catch. And then... Philadelphia turns it over in one play, and the Cowboys get a 29-28 victory on the road in Lincoln Financial Field and improve to 4-5 and five on the season. You can't ever count out this team. You also can't put too much faith in them, but they do come away with a victory today. And somehow Vic throws 17 passes in this game. They had a lot of three and outs, actually. We had the ball for majority of this game. They had 12 runs with Shady McCoy, and uh, it was just all about Des Bryant making that game-winning catch and Romo playing well in the fourth quarter. Very surprising, I know. It's, it's definitely turning over a new leaf for Dallas. But next episode, we can go potentially to 500, 5-5 five and five if we can knock off the Cleveland Browns. And so, please, if you guys enjoyed the video, do leave a like and a comment on the video. And don't forget to check out some Oakland Raiders Connected Careers Mode series later tonight. So thank you guys for watching. I'll see you guys next time.